Okay, today we're going to be making vegetarian curry. It's a classic. Two onions chopped. Four or five cloves of garlic and a knob of ginger chopped. Cook down the onions until started to brown. Add chopped garlic and chopped ginger. Add a handful of curry leaves. Stir them in until they start to crackle. And then add a teaspoon of mustard seeds. Brown. Stir it all in. Add any combination of garam masala, coriander, turmeric, paprika, chili powder, cumin, curry powder, and salt. Add your preferred spice mix to the onion mix. And stir until these spices are cooked through. In this one, I've got curry powder, turmeric, chili, coriander. And that's it. Oh yeah, and some garam masala. Add some chopped tomatoes and a little bit of water to the mix. Bring that to the boil, cook it down. Depending on how hot you like it, you can add a chili. Split it or chop it. Add or don't add the seeds, depending on how hot you like it. <laughs> Choose your vegetables. I've chosen ladies' fingers, baby aubergine, pepper, grate a little bit of cream coconut into the curry. Looking good. Add the vegetables to the curry mix with one hand. Stir them in. Add a bit more water and some frozen peas. Put a lid on, turn the heat down, simmer, stirring occasionally. Get some nice fresh coriander, chop it up. Add half of it to the curry while it's cooking. When the curry's cooked, add a bit of coriander as a garnish. You can have some tomatoes if you like. There they are. And it's almost cooked now. Give it about 20 minutes to cook all the hard vegetables down. Serve it up with some basmati rice. Curry, vegetarian style, done.